Hey kids, my name is Fizzledorn Whifflesnuff, and I'm going to be reading a story for you called The Farmer, His Son, and the Donkey by Aesop. Now, a long, long time ago, a farmer and his son were on their way to market with a donkey that they hoped to sell. They walked him very slowly, for they thought they would have a better chance to sell him if they kept him in good condition. As they walked along the highway, some travelers laughed loudly at them. How foolish, they cried, to walk when they might as well ride. Seems the donkey is not the most stupid of the three. Well, the farmer did not like to be laughed at, so he told his son to climb up and ride. They went a little way farther along the road when three merchants passed by. Oh, ho! What have we here, they jeered. Respect old age, young man. Get down and let that old man ride. Though the farmer was not tired, he made the boy get down and climbed up himself to ride, just to please the merchants. Well, at the next road, they overtook some women, carrying baskets loaded with vegetables to sell at the market. Those ladies took a look at that farmer on the donkey and said, Look at that selfish old man, perched on the donkey, while that poor boy has to walk behind them. Well, the farmer was getting tired of this nonsense, but to be agreeable, he told his son to climb up behind him. No sooner than they had started again, when a loud shout went up from another group up the very same road. What a crime, cried one, to load up a poor beast like that. Those humans look more able to carry the poor donkey than he to carry them. They must be going to sell that donkey for meat, said another. The farmer and his son quickly scrambled down, and a short time later, the marketplace was thrown into an uproar as the two came along carrying the donkey slung from a pole. A great crowd of people ran out to get a closer look at the strange sight. Well, the donkey did not like being carried, but so many people came up to him to point and laugh and shout that he began to kick and bray. And then, just as they were crossing a bridge, he was kicking so hard that the ropes gave way and he tumbled down into the river, lost forever. The poor farmer now set out sadly for home. By trying to please everybody, he'd pleased nobody and lost his donkey in the process. Just goes to show, if you try to please everybody, you end up pleasing nobody. Well, that's all the time this old man has to spin a yarn. Check back soon for another story from Character Stories for Children.